Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Daisy, and we're working on her downstay. Now, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be working on Daisy's downstay with distractions. Now, Daisy still struggles a little bit to stay down whenever there's a distraction in the room, especially another dog, and so today we're turning it up a notch. Now, it can't be seen on screen, but a lot of Daisy's friends are outside playing, and she has a very clear view of them. So what we're going to be doing is practicing her downstay using that as our distraction because the eventual goal is that we'll be able to have another dog running around and Daisy will remain in that downstay. Now I'm going to go ahead. Come on. You see she's in a very nice down, but I'm just going to get her set up in a better position. Daisy, down. Yes. I'm going to go ahead and treat her. Stay. And you see I'm treating nice and low to the ground and then treating um, afterwards. Stay. And I'm just going to start walking around. Like I said, she has a very clear view to outside. She can see all the dogs running around. And so I really want to pay attention to her body movements. Yes. To see if there's anything there, stay, that might hint me that she's going to pop up. And I'm not leaving too much distance just because we're not ready to add that many elements to a command just yet. Yes. It's doing really good so far. Uh-uh. You see right there, she got up to meet my hand for the treat. So I just did a vocal correction, and I'm going to wait a couple seconds for rewarding. Stay. We want to make sure that we're waiting those couple seconds in between corrections, just so that Daisy isn't manipulating us into thinking that if she breaks, she's going to get beat faster. Yes. Stay. She's doing really good. I'm going to change directions on her. Stay. And she is glancing outside. I can see that she is clearly affected by the dogs outside, but I like that she's turning her focus more towards me. Yes. Stay. We're going to do one more lap. Yes. All right, I'm going to tap on the head to release. Okay. And that was a really nice job from Daisy. You can see she definitely was distracted today. She was glancing outside a lot. And even though she did break once, overall she did a really good, good job of holding that down, stay really good job of staying planted. She wasn't shifting around too much. She wasn't moving her feet too much. Really nice job. Overall, really good job from Daisy. Nice. You did awesome.